I am Kate Dillon and I'm the founder and creative director of SheLine. All about advocating for Australian manufacturing and the incredible skill set we have here in our backyard. Can we make a product that is end-to-end -end Australian made, that will bring awareness to small business, that will support as many other small business artisan makers as I could find to be part of that process? What happened with Kate was uh, she made contact with us and she said, I want to make a very, very nice fleecy fabric. Kate you know, came in and I thought her concept was fantastic, the way she wanted to do it. She's been transparent about everything she's doing. Kate came on board last year and I absolutely adore her and, and, uh, and what she's doing with the, with, uh, the local product and, and how she's supporting it. And um, it's just tremendous and it's an inspiration. This is uh, where it all happens with uh, the knitting mill. This is where we turn organic cotton um, into fabric. In here we do all garment dyeing, so we do all different types, silks, wools, but mainly cotton. That's the staple fibre that we produce. So when Kate sent the design through, um, it gets prepared in the, in the art department and then put, put into a format that we can make a silk screen out of and then it gets sent to computer. And then we've got our manual carousels where the boys and girls set up their jobs and, and print, so we're quite flexible here. At the end of a 12 month period, all over Zoom, um, during multiple extended lockdowns in Victoria, uh, we created 100% cotton, Australian made, pretty much all made in Melbourne, 22 businesses, 20 in Melbourne. Beautiful, beautiful sweatshirts that are emblazoned with the word, actually I can, and support local. Support local, I think, is a fantastic concept. And that's the sort of thing that we really do need with a bit of assistance and a bit of help from the government that, you know, they push the local made, which is uh, a good thing. The money's not going offshore, it's remaining here and it puts people in jobs and food on the table for those people in jobs. And that's as simple as it goes. One garment touches 300 hands, 300 Australian hands, 300 Melbourne hands, to get from zero to where, and, and that gives me goosebumps. Make It Melbourne to me is good energy and like a bright future and an incredible opportunity for us to galvanise and reignite what we had.